Welcome back to my dark corner of this sick world. Yeah, goodbye. Even when it's an American film, it's always Japan that suffers when there's a giant monster on the loose. This is Korean. Oh, well, that's okay then. You may think you recognize this guy. Ask him if his name is King Kong. But actually, this is Ape. Released the same year as Dino De Laurentiis' Kong reboot, to which it makes a sly reference. Well, I didn't want to wrinkle my costume, Dino. But different in many ways. Now, what kind of bullshit are you trying to hand me? For starters, Ape was shot in 3D, something you may occasionally spot. <laughs> Another difference is that Ape can throw some serious shapes on the dance floor. Story-wise, Ape is similar to Kong. Just a story of your average giant gorilla of... Almost 36 feet. I'm oh, sorry, how tall? <laughs> towering over buildings, then how big is this shark? With which he again seems to be dancing. Also like Kong, Ape seems to fancy human women. <coughs> Peeping Kong. <coughs> but unlike Kong, he actually seems to be in with a shot. He channeled it. That's weird. You slut! Very weird. Do you think that's right? I really don't think it is. Also weird is that when the girl escapes, Ape follows her. The goddamn monkey's following him. And yet they choose to hide in Seoul, the most populous city in Korea. I think you can see where this is heading. <laughs> oh, the cardboard humanity. But it's all right, the city is being evacuated. Please evacuate the neighborhood. Move in an orderly fashion to the south. With one exception. <laughs> How stupid do you have to be? Are you sure this isn't some sort of gag? And that's the problem. I'm actually not sure. You gotta be kidding. I really can't tell if this is supposed to be a comedy or a drama. Come well, on, must everything you say be a joke? On the one hand, hundreds of Koreans are killed. I've got casualties, goddammit! I'm gonna have more casualties! On the other... On the one hand, this looks almost like Sergei Eisenstein's King Kong. And this doesn't. Part of the problem is that whether it's action comedy or action adventure, Ape is surprisingly tedious, featuring the most staid scenes of modern city destruction. <laughs> and almost 10 solid minutes of giant ape bombardment. <laughs> If I can't tell whether it's a drama or a comedy, it's obviously failed. Oh, shit. If it's a comedy, then it's the least funny one I've ever seen. If it's a drama, then it's the funniest I've ever seen. <laughs> On balance, if only because of Ape's touching death scene, It's just too big for a small world like ours. I think it's supposed to be a drama. But I've been wrong before. Let's see him dance for his organ grinder now! If you've got a film you'd like us to review, leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe.